Welcome back to my channel, where today we are going to talk about one of the most controversial and dangerous conspiracy theorists of our times, Alex Jones, and his opinions about one of the most tragic events in American history, the 9-11 attacks. Let's explore further into Jones's beliefs surrounding the 9-11 attacks and how he leverages his platform to propagate false information and instill terror in his audience. According to Jones's theories, the American government intentionally carried out the 9-11 attacks, using it as a pretext to wield more power and control over citizens. Despite the overwhelming evidence to the contrary, Jones continues to spread this unproven and unsubstantiated claim, eroding public trust in reliable news sources and further polarizing his followers to his cause. Jones uses fear to manipulate his audience and to validate his own inaccurate beliefs, causing great harm to society as a whole. To understand why Jones believes these outlandish claims, we must take into account his deep-seated mistrust of government institutions, which he believes are out to oppress American citizens. Jones believes that these shadowy entities must have carried out the attacks to pave the way for a new world order that would lead to the subjugation of the masses. In his opinion, the U.S. government used the attacks as an excuse to invade Iraq and Afghanistan and impose its will on these nations. Jones also claims that the government covered up evidence of explosives being planted at the World Trade Center and the Pentagon to maintain its narrative. This perspective has sparked significant controversy and ignited a heated debate among scholars, experts, and the public. Critics argue that such claims lack substantial evidence and base their arguments on conspiracy theories. On the other hand, supporters of Jones assert that the government's actions were driven by ulterior motives, citing inconsistencies in the official narrative and citing alternative explanations for the events that unfolded on that fateful day. This ongoing dispute highlights the deep distrust that exists between segments of society and the government underscoring the need for transparency and accountability in democratic systems. While conspiracy theories can fuel tension and division, they also serve as a reminder of the importance of critical thinking, thorough investigation, and open dialogue in evaluating and questioning the actions of those in power. A nuanced understanding of complex events like these requires careful consideration of all available evidence, expert analysis, and diverse perspectives to ensure a comprehensive and accurate comprehension of historical events. Jones's theories are not only baseless but also dangerous, as they fuel hatred and mistrust of the government. Moreover, they undermine the suffering of the people who lost their lives on 9 11 and their families. In one visual, we can present the footage of the planes hitting the World Trade Center, juxtaposed with Jones's claims that the attack was staged. In another segment, we can debunk Jones's claim that the government covered up the evidence of explosives planted at the World Trade Center. We can present the findings of the National Institute of Standards and Technology, which concluded that the collapse of the buildings was due to the impact of the airplanes and the ensuing fires. The NIST, renowned for its scientific expertise and objective investigation, thoroughly examined every aspect of the World Trade Center collapse. Their exhaustive study involved a comprehensive analysis of the structural integrity, materials used, and the sequence of events leading to the catastrophic failure of the Twin Towers. Tillizing advanced computer simulations and conducting physical experiments, the NIST conclusively determined that the combination of the planes crashing into the buildings and the resulting intense fires were the primary factors behind the furthermore. The NIST findings also debunked the notion that explosives were planted within the buildings. Their comprehensive investigation found no evidence whatsoever to support such claims. Instead, it was the immense heat generated from the jet fuel fires that weakened the steel and led to the ultimate collapse of the World Trade Center towers. By presenting these irrefutable findings from the NIST, 
we can effectively debunk Jones's conspiracy theory and shed light on the factual explanation behind the tragic events of September 11, 2001. The meticulous scientific research conducted by the NIST definitively refutes any notions of a government cover-up and provides an authoritative perspective on the true causes of the World Trade Center collapse. Dot collapse. These fires, fueled by thousands of gallons of jet fuel, weakened the structural components and caused the steel to lose its load-bearing capacity. In conclusion, it is important to call out individuals like Alex Jones for their dangerous rhetoric and their lies. We must stand up for the truth and reject conspiracy theories that only serve to divide and mislead people. It is crucial to hold accountable those who spread misinformation, as their actions can have severe consequences on society. By challenging their false narratives and exposing the truth, we can safeguard the integrity of public discourse and ensure that factual information is readily available to all. It is our responsibility as informed citizens to critically analyze the information we consume and to promote a culture of critical thinking and fact-checking. Only by doing so can we create a more informed and united society free from the grips of misinformation. Together, we can counteract the harmful influence of individuals like Alex Jones and work towards a future built on truth, understanding, and mutual respect.